Many court cases involve someone making an offer and then withdrawing it before the other person can accept it. It happens a lot, so lawyers need to understand how to respond. One decision that provides guidance is the New York case of Pedersen v. Patberg. John Pedersen owned a house in New York and made quarterly mortgage payments to George Patberg. In April of 1924, Pedersen still owed over $5,000, and the mortgage had more than five years to run. On April 4th, Patberg wrote to Pedersen, offering to reduce the outstanding balance on the mortgage by $780 if Pedersen made the quarterly payment due on April 25th and then paid off the discounted balance in cash before May 31st. Patberg's letter read, quote, I hereby agree to accept cash for the mortgage which I hold, unquote, if Pedersen made the required payments. Pedersen made the April 25th payment and in late May knocked on Patberg's door with cash in hand to pay off the balance. But when Pedersen told Patberg why he was there, Patberg announced that he'd already sold the mortgage to someone else, so the offer was no longer available. Pedersen then sued Patberg for his $780 loss. The trial court awarded Pedersen judgment in full, and the appellate division affirmed. Patberg then appealed to the New York Court of Appeals, the highest court in the state of New York. 